What up guys, Mick Dizzle here, and in this video, I am going to show you how to get to the Seraphim Vault. It is going to be in the expansion pack, it, something wolf. I don't know the specific name, but it's going to be dropping December 9th, and I am going to show you the glitch of how to get in there before it is released. So, first up, we're going to go to Earth, or Cosmodrome, whatever one you call it, and we're going to go on Patrol. And we're off. Oh, sorry about, and another thing, sorry about the quality. New to, new to YouTube, so I don't have any good gear or, like, equipment that I can use. So, yeah, this is the best I have. <laughs> Now, once we spawn, we are going to go over to the Forgotten Shore. Now, if you want to, skip it from here. But I am just going to go normal speed. I'm not going to fast forward anything for those who act who don't know where to go. So if you do know where to go, just skip. Alright, we are at the Forgotten Shore, so we are going to go to the back of this mountain. <laughs> this is where, of course, the first step, it's tricky. It may take you a few tries, it might not, but you have to make sure that you are right here right in this general area what you're gonna do is take out your ghost and notice how it says summon vehicle you are going to try and get as close to this wall as you can without it saying unable to summon now an easy way to do it is to look out the opposite way and back up slowly and then once you think you're at the maximum point turn around and then spawn it but I am definitely close enough right now, so I'm going to spawn it. You should glitch into the wall. Like this. Now, it's okay if you come off of the bike when you fall, because you can walk around. Now, there is a ghost down here. It is actually where we need to go. So I'm just going to head over here. Oh, wait. When you fall down... You go to the right, over here. Alright. You're going to go right over there. The ghost should be right here. I've already gotten it, that's why it's not there. But, our first step into this, is that we have to jump up here. Do not go into here, or you're going to glitch back up onto the top. You don't want that to happen. So from here, you're going to jump over to the, this ledge. <clears throat> Whoops. When you jump over, it's going to stop, and it's going to say loading. You want that to happen, or it won't work. Okay? 
So jump, loading, and now it's going to do this. Jump down, but do not go over there. There is nothing, you will just fall down. What you want to do is go over here. And then this is where I like to I like to call this part from here on hardcore parkour because it's nothing but jumping. So from here you're going to jump on top of this. Whoa. Well, don't do what I did. That's for sure. All right. Well, jump up to here. It's okay if you go over, but you're going to want to go on top of this for this next part. Because see, you get stuck right there. Alright, from there, you're going to want to go all the way across. Now you're going to want to jump in between that and that wall right here. Because if you don't, you're going to get stuck. So you're going to walk over here, go down on top of this. You can jump down and walk over there. I'm just going to glide over there. But you have, you're going to go on to this beam. And then from there, you're going to jump on top of that. Or over it. This is where it starts to get harder. Alright, so you have to get on top of this. And then you have to jump over and land on that. You land on one of these yellow button looking things. And then from here, you're going to jump in between these two posts. Alright, then we're going to scale all the way across to the end, right over here. I'm going to show it all, so you guys know what to do, even though you might already know. It's okay that it glitches out over here, because it's just going to reappear. But once we're over here, don't go over to the right or the left. You're going to want to jump straight over. In this next part, I remember it as the vault of glass jump when you jump off the cliff. You're going to go over here and jump off from there. Alright, so we're going to jump over here, and we're going to jump down there. This is why I call it the Vault of Glass Jump, because it's so big. And if you do manage to die, it's okay, because you're just going to spawn right back up there, and you can redo the jump. Now see, I can't show you anything from here on. But what you're going to do is you're going to make sure you have two people in the in the party. Like you can invite somebody and whoever, but what you got to do is if you already have the two in there, when you're already here, have one of them leave and then spawn back to you and they're going to spawn in here. They're going to spawn inside the vault. And then once they're in, wait for their confirmation and then promote them to leader. And then leave yourself and join their sp their fire team. And you, you're going to both be in there. Now, I recall there being one ghost in there. But I can't show you because I only have one person in here. But that should be dropping. Like, this vault should be dropping in December. So, have fun with it. And explore. And that's all I have. So, Nick, there's a lot.